Yo guys, what is going on and welcome back to a brand new WWE Supercar video episode 68 with me, Cool Guy, and you, the awesome viewers. In the last episode, guys, I got my King of the Ring rewards, one Ultimate card, one Elite card, and they weren't really that good. Now, I looked through the comments and some people were like, oh, just be happy with what you got. Well, I'm actually not, because in the stage of the game I'm at, I don't want those kind of cards, but it is what it is. Um, this will probably be the last video where I leave up all the ultimate pulls you guys can see over there. I don't know why I haven't taken them down yet, because I just think that wall looks pretty cool. So what I might do instead is just do that, but instead of having like sometimes the, the same wrestler twice or something like that, I will just do a whole wall of all the ultimate pulls, or, or maybe ultimate pros that I've got, something like that. So yeah, if you guys want to see that, yeah, I'll do it. Perfect. So this video, guys, is going to be a little bit about how to win King of the Rings. And what 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 to do in King of the Rings? So I got a comment in last uh, in last video saying why do I have two rares in my King of the Ring? Just put two ultimates. Now to answer to you, I saw a viewer answered you back to say it was sandbagging to to you know to come up against easier opponents, which is obviously true. So yeah, how to win King of the Rings? How to uh, kind of just be better at them? And if you're if you're really having enough trouble even qualifying or even like semi-finals or even coming to the finals. Because let's say you're in an elite king of the ring, if you want to get an elite card, you have to make it all the way to the finals. And it's not very easy to do that all the time. So, what, I'm, what I do in my king of the rings is, I normally choose one tag team to, um, to sandbag. Okay, so it's either my diva tag, or it's either my male tag. Sometimes it will be my female tag and my male tag, but that is a little bit risky. Okay, so that's one form of sandbagging. Now, this is this. All I'm doing right now is explaining this for people who maybe are a little bit new or who don't know what this is. So I know about 80% of you guys will know everything about this, but I'm just gonna go through this anyways. So this is the first form of sandbagging by putting like a rare, uncommon. Uh, you can do whatever you want, but just make sure that they're not very, they're not very good, and they're not. Okay. Um, so yeah, if I come up, for example, against two uncom, two uncommons. Um, I will beat them with this tag team. I'll beat them, and this actually happened to me in, in the King of the Ring. I was just I was in before. But anyway, that's the first form of sandbagging. There's another way you can sandbag. It's it's called sandbag as well. Um, sorry if you guys heard that, but I'm not sure if you guys did. But um, yeah, the other form of sandbagging <coughs> is getting a card that's going to be really good. It doesn't have to be a pro. I mean, if you're if you're like in a hard and in a hard and King of the Ring, and you get yourself an ultimate card then that ultimate card will be good enough. So what you want to do is, with the card that's really good, um, you want to keep it on level zero. Okay, I proed my Fimbala yesterday in the live stream. I think it was in the live stream. I might, well, I'm not sure now. But anyway, I proed my Fimbala, and what that means is, um, he, what, what, what that means is he's now level zero. So what I can do with that is I'm just drop him in King of the Ring. He's going to tag with Mankind, or I might swap that out to tag with Bret Hart. I don't know, actually, but we'll see. He's going to go in this King of the Ring, that is for sure, because he's a good card, and he's low left arrow. So, but he's also level zero, which means the ultimate bar is full right now, but that's 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 like a visual glitch, if you kind of want. I don't know if Supercard did that on purpose or not, but the second you get into ultimate King of the Ring tier, it's not going to go a little bit or halfway. It's going to go, it's going to max it out all the way. Just like when you change it in ranked, for example. When, when you go from ultimate plus to ultimate plus plus, even if you're not fully an ultimate plus plus and you're only halfway an ultimate plus plus as there's no tier after ultimate plus plus it fills the whole bar um, because look if I for example swap out my Nia Jax with oh I don't literally I've just used all my cards up but it doesn't matter um, yeah if I, try, if I if I swap out a couple cards it's gonna take me to elite like straight away because I am like on the verge of being an elite already with these two cards in and this Finn Balor. But what I want to also do is get myself a Barack Lesnar in here, who is also um, who's also uh, sandbagged, okay? Brock Lesnar as well, and I'll make Brock Lesnar tag with Neville in this tag team, okay? I will untake this sandbag tagged, I'll do this, and I'll sandbag my Diva tag instead. Very simple, very, very simple. So yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing. If you guys have any more questions on what to do with like King of the Rings and those kind of things, then let me know. Uh, I'm not going to be starting a King of the Ring in the next couple of days. I just want to get my, my cards pro and those kind of things, make sure I can at least win the, the, the next King of the Ring. But at this point, King of the Rings, I'm only literally, I'm only doing, I'm only going to be doing King of the Rings for your entertainment because at this point, I don't need to. They're a drag to do. I don't need any other ultimate cards. I mean, would I love an AJ Styles pro? Yes. Would I love maybe an Alexa Bliss? Yes. But apart from those cards. I literally have, and maybe a Samojo, and that apart from that, I've got every other good card. I mean, 
Yeah, all right, perfect. So um, this is where my Brock Lesnar's are at. They're not knit, almost done, but they're not. They're not at the beginning. They're all level 45. Um, yeah, we're just going to keep doing this. I'm going to be streaming uh, later on uh, f during the Elimination Chamber. So this video is going to go straight up on my channel as soon as I finish recording it. Uh, and I'll be streaming during Elimination Chamber. So if you guys want to see reactions, my reactions to Elimination Chamber live, then uh, yeah, watch the live stream. Okay, uh, I will be playing Supercard while reacting to the, sh to, the, to, the, to the live stream. So if I'm not always playing Supercard, forgive me for that. Uh, but yeah, uh, obviously I can't show... Uh, the actual, the actual, you know, the actual picture of it, the, you know, well, you know what I'm trying to say, the actual elimination chain, I can't show that, I can put the volume on, so you guys can watch it as well, and then if you, you, you while you guys are watching it, you guys can put the stream on, if, if you guys want, obviously, and then you'll hear, you'll hear my reaction, if you guys want that, obviously, you might, people might not, but I will be, I will be streaming live during Elimination Chamber tonight, um, yeah, it might. Yeah, I might. I, I might. I might not at this point. I'm. You know, I. I want to. But elimination chamber is obviously the main event, which will end at like five o'clock in the morning. But we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I. Uh, yeah. But I think that might be a fun thing to do. So if you guys want to see that, make sure you guys drop by. Also, um, I want to thank you guys so much for the support we've been getting on this channel recently. Like, uh, genuinely, it has blown my mind. Um, the video I uploaded for the uh, ring the team ring domination glitch for the unlimited ultimate pulls that video is now on um, eight thousand five hundred two views, which uh, it's it's a shock to me. So thank you guys so much for that. Like eight thousand five hundred views in four days. You got I don't know I don't know. You guys killed it. We've gained like three four hundred subscribers in the last couple of days. Yeah, to all of you guys who likes the videos, who comments, who watches all of them, and and who just who just enjoys my content, thank you guys, it means the world to me that I can entertain you guys and, and do what I love doing, so yeah, thank you guys, sorry for that cheesy speech at the end, So we're gonna, this is a quite a short video, we're going to play one more game and we'll end it there, um, but yeah, we finally released an episode of 2K17 as well last night, which is episode 3, I've already pre-recorded episode 4, so well, you guys won't have to wait a whole week to see it, I'll probably upload that every, five or f every 4 to 5 days, I know that's still a long time, but... With WWE Champions as well, and Supercut, and me live streaming, or just on YouTube now, I don't want to overflow uh, my channel with content because that is not just not going to be something that is a good. It's just not a good thing. So yeah, I mean at this point, with if you count live streams, if you count the Super Daily episodes, and the 2K17s, or the uh, predictions videos, or the Champions videos, or the all those kind of videos, I'm uploading about three videos a day. Um, and if it's not three, then it's pretty much two. So that's, that's pretty hard to keep up, but I'm going to try my best for you guys. Thank you guys very much for watching this episode. Uh, that's another win for us. I'm just going to keep training up this Brock Lesnar. And it's going to take some time, but we got this. We got we're trying to get Brock Lesnar, try and get the hardened card as well. It's always, it's always good to get a hardened card, you know, just for catalogue reasons and just for training up and for, for those kind of things. So, yeah, perfect. I'm not sure who it is, actually. No, it's Xavier Woods, isn't it? Yeah, of course, it's Xavier Woods. I don't know. I don't know why I thought it was like a different event or something. But yeah, um, let's go ahead and get that one. Are we going to get a shard on, on video, please? Can we get a shard on video? It doesn't look like we're going to. Yay, we do. Give me an ultimate ball, damn it. All right. <laughs> All right, thank you guys so much for watching the episode. You guys are awesome. Smash the like on the video if you've enjoyed it. If you guys want to see more videos just like this, make sure you guys subscribe. Click that little bell so you guys get notified as soon as I upload or as soon as I go live. And until I see you in the live stream, if you guys are going to be there, take care. And peace out.